Hey guys, Dual Genius 4545 here, back once again with more Banjo Tooie. In the last episode, we did a uh, did a bunch of weird things. We got some fries right before we ended off the episode. I actually never really looked. I didn't realize that they don't only give you one fries. You get five. So we have five fries and five burgers, but really, it's just one. I guess it doesn't really matter. Those will come into play later, so don't worry about that right now. I don't know when they'll come into play, but it'll, it'll be eventually. You don't gotta worry about it. Now I'm gonna come up here and see what the heck this is, because I think this serves some purpose. Can I get up here? Yes, I can. Hey, dude, how you doing? You're gone now. Okay. So, oh boy, is this another, like, tiptoe segment? I know I need to get out to that thing. Okay, camera, work with me, work with me. Alright, let's give it a shot. Man, I'm good. Look at that. Check it out. Now let's hit this. No, I want to hit the button. I know I need to hit the button. But there we go. Alright. <laughs> that was completely pointless. Alright, so now I think it's any time that I stand on it, it'll move. Yeah. Oh, great. Give me a second, guys. I got a cough. Alright, we're good. Now, let's see. Okay, no, it's a cutscene. I thought maybe you were supposed to use this thing to actually get on top of this tent here, but apparently not. We'll do that later, though, because obviously we need to get that Jinjo. Now, I guess we're just gonna... Gonna? Just say gonna? We're gonna just kind of figure out where this takes us. Apparently right here. Does this serve any purpose? Or am I just completely wasting my time? I mean, there's empty honeycomb up here. That's nice. But I don't, I don't think... I don't know if we need to be here right now. I guess it doesn't hurt to be here right now. I could have sworn that was supposed to be a grip grab area. What the heck, game? Well, great. What do I do now? Can I come over here and like... I need to get up there. I know I do. Apparently this isn't the way to go about doing it though. Unless it was just being a complete jerk to me and that was the way to do it and they're just screwing with me here. Come on. I'm gonna keep trying. I know that has to be the way. They can't lie to me. Hold on, let me get a better angle on this. Let's try it again. There we go. I knew it. Knew this was the way to go. Cause we need to get up here to even give us the easier path to get up here. Because there's a, a switch eventually. I saw it. You might have seen it too. Makes a shot jump pad. No, I don't want to peck it nothing. I want to hit the shot jump pad. I always try to geek bash things. But seems like in this game, every single button, all you're supposed to do is step on it. But I can't break the habit. Alright, let's see. Gotta open this thingy. And we'll get to see an old friend that we all don't really know or love, but they're here. Alright, are they she gonna tell me if I go out here? No, screw you, I gotta go this way. We're gonna have to go back and get the food because she's gonna take it away from us. So whatever. We have to come out here, it is absolutely essential to the game that we come out here. I think. It should be. Uh, is there going to be a blockage here? Did I never, I never went back and did that, did I? Oh, great. Well, when we go back to the, when we go back to the level again, I guess we'll have to do that. Obviously, that was a Glitter Gulch mine right there. You could probably guess what's supposed to happen, but since I'm too dumb to have remembered to go back and do that, I'm going to have to do that when I, when I go back the next time. After I get the move that I need to get before I can go back there. Actually, I need a bunch of moves before I can go back there. But, I'll just try to get one. If I can get one Jiggy when I go back there, it's okay. Alright, let's see if we can pull this off. Come on. Camera ever will work with me. I don't know what it is. I mean, this doesn't actually have anything to do with the camera. It's just more me wondering why when I start recording, I have to cough a whole bunch. But I swear, I've been talking to friends all day today, and I have never once felt the need to cough. And now it's 
every two seconds. I feel the need to cough. Alright, either way, as usual, either way, just like, my, my, what's the word for it? My saying? I thought there was another word for it, but I guess saying works. It's just what I always say is, well, either way, I don't, I don't know why. It kind of annoys me, but I can't really stop doing it. Alright, I know there's some special way to do this. Well, I know this isn't it. Oh, uh, you had to have... Ooh, ooh, I, I bet you I know. <laughs> oh, come on! That doesn't work. That would have been too cool, huh? Too cool. Let me see. This sign probably tells me something. Ring the bell to win the top... Oh, gee, thank you. Never would have guessed. Ah, oh, jeez. Alright, there's some special third thing that I have to do there, but I don't remember at all. Shut up. Okay, so we're gonna look around here for a little bit longer. I think Mumbo's house is... I think it's Mumbo's house is right up here. Not, not here. Turn camera, please. There we go. Alright. More of these. God damn it. See, I told you I would get hit by those things. I don't know why. I just can't seem to dodge. I'm, just, I'm trying to resist the urge to cough right now. Oh. Uh, it's, it's not easy. I don't know why. I mean, I've been talking all day. I guess I... Well... I don't know. I might have been coughing. I have a terrible memory. I can't remember if I was coughing. But I, I probably did. Because normally when I'm talking on mumble, I don't need to worry about coughing because I had to press a button to talk in the first place. I saw an area up here. No, that's just the outside of the map. There's probably not a globo in here this time. Wait, do I have a globo? No. Oh, there is a globo in here. Do I want one? Yeah, I probably do want Wombo. Wombo's a little bit more important than other things. Gotta check the posters. Get yes, their posters. Their wall hanging thingies. I'll get Wombo later. I don't want to do it right now. Because once I get Wombo, I gotta turn into that thing. That opens a whole bunch of other things that I gotta go do. And I'd rather not. Actually, yeah, you know what, I'll do it later. Screw that. Hold on, guys. Give me a sec. Okay, we're good. Maybe. Probably not for very long, but we're good for now. God damn it, I just want to get up here and get the ginger, please. Ugh. I hope this one's not evil. I mean, how many gingers are we? I guess we probably only got one. Either that or two. No, we got two, because there was that one that was being really annoying in the monster gallery thing. So that's three... Oh. Well, uh, yay, we finished off the white Jinjo family. Now you can see what happens when we finish off a Jinjo family. It'll do this super cool cutscene. It goes all the way through Jinjo Village. And all like... Oh man, you got one Jinjo for this family. This guy must be really lonely. Like, all the other Jinjo families got, like, four, five, twelve people, and he's, like, one guy. Oh, yeah, they don't actually give us the Jiggy. Oh, wait, I lied. They they actually give us the Jiggy. I could have sworn when you got the Jiggy, it would appear inside the house, and you actually had to go there and get it. I was completely wrong. There. Excuse me for being so terribly, terribly wrong. I felt like I knew more about this game, but I just don't remember half the stuff that's in it. Oh, hey, it's, it's you. Now that Jinju over there is definitely extremely evil. I know you are. What'd she say? Oh, uh, she wants food. Right. At least I'm pretty sure that's what she said. You know what? Since I know this Jinju is evil, watch him. Watch him. Watch him. <laughs> ah, that's fun. Okay. Well, he's gone now. We don't need to worry about him. Is this... What move is this? This is probably nothing I really care about. What? Oh. Oh, it's a move for Banjo. That's another special thing. Since we have the split-up pads now, which I, th 
I know there's split up pads somewhere around here. I'm guessing I need to blow this up. Yep. You son of a bitch. I'm trying to blow shit up here. Don't don't hit me with your damn hammer. Alright, so I just like to throw stuff at us. It's really easy to get to, I mean. I have to go in here anyways, and there's still Oh. Okay, well, we don't need to be in here just yet. <coughs> Sorry, guys. Okay, I'll be right back again. Ugh. All right, we're good. So we need to come over here to our split up heads. Probably go get this move for Banjo over here. It's probably something special that we need. Obviously, that if you saw before, that room was called the pump room. And there's a pump that leads straight to this strangely bouncy blow up house looking thingy that probably is a pretty big hint as to what the the uh blo blow up pump room is for but this room room god i suck it <laughs> wow don't forget your hat there you go all right but now we have this it's pretty well i guess i do use it now that i think about it i do all right but yeah, it actually isn't really needed right now at all. But it's nice to have for later. Now, as you can see, these little switches in here have shinies on them. And that is because if it has a picture of Banjo on it, I can stand on it here and then switch to Kazooie. And it's, it's pretty neat. Ah, give me a sec, guys. Alright, I'm probably good for now. Jeez. Maybe I shouldn't have recorded today. I needed to record though. I need to need to keep up the the whatchamacallit. You know, I need to continue to keep my my schedule, that's what it is, my schedule. I need to keep my schedule going. Or else I don't know, nothing. But I gotta keep my schedule going. It's it's extremely important. Not really. Okay, so now we can just come right over here and grab Banjo. And then we can go inside this nice little blow-up tent house thingy out here. Not really a blow-up tent house thingy, it's a blow-up... What the heck are those called? They're like the... The jumping... I don't know what they're called. I'm pretty sure they have a name. I don't know the name for them really wish I had not gone in there and kept my fries and stuff. I don't think I actually even needed to go in there. I thought maybe I needed to go in there to trigger the cutscene of the thingy coming out, but I was wrong. You don't actually need to do that. Alright, I guess first things first, we'll take Banjo. But yeah, when you go in here, you only need one of each person. So we'll start off with Banjo first, mostly just because it's easier uh i lied let's get out i was totally wrong there's a mission with both of them and a mission with only kazooie whatever let's just do the kazooie one i don't feel like switching back to both of them kazooie is fun to play as anyways super fast oh yeah that's another thing i don't know if you noticed but whenever you split up your health gets halved so that that's kind of neat kind of sucks at the same time but you know, what are you gonna do? Alright, so yes, this game, like she's saying, you got 60 seconds to basically run around and go through all these hoops. Uh, blue ones are three points, green ones are two points, and red ones are one point. And so you basically just want to run around and get all the hoops that you can. Good thing the jumping physics are a little bit funky. No, I want that blue hoop, give it. There we go. Alright, I don't remember how many points you said we have to get. Might have been, uh, 30, I think. Especially, like, half a point, or one point every two seconds or something like that. I don't think it's too hard, though. As long as you don't miss every single blue hoop. I should, 
you really shouldn't even bother going for red hoops unless they're on your path because it's really just a waste of time and points to go for red ones. Now let's see, she's probably going to tell me like, you did it, but if you get a higher score, I'll give you a better prize or something. That's my guess, because this seems too easy to get all the prizes. Let's see what she's going to say, like, do better. No, you can't have scored enough, blah, blah, yeah, I did. No, what are you going to give me? It can't possibly be over, there's no way. Ugh. I'm nearly better. I just need to get a good night's sleep for once, and then I won't have any problems of being better. Do I want to play again? No. Apparently that was it. Alright guys, well that's all the time we have for this episode. I hope you enjoy it. Hopefully in the next episode I'll be not sick anymore, so I can be a little bit more lively. Yeah right, I'm never lively, but... You know, I won't sound so nasty. See you guys there. Later.